So in our third and final module, we're going to take a look at standing waves and resonance. One way to think of standing waves and then ultimately resonance is to consider uh, an example like a guitar string. And in that situation, uh, when the string is struck and the string begins to vibrate, the wave Itself is seemingly stuck, and so, it, for lack of a better term, on the string. And what you get is a result of repeated reflection and superposition, which we took a look at uh, in our study of wave behaviors. Um, and that reflection and superposition generates a standing wave that ultimately would stay on that guitar string until ultimately the energy that it possesses dissipates.